हाई फ्रेंड्स आई एम शोइंग यू द रेसिपी ऑफ हाउ टू मेक भिंडी दो प्याजा सो फर्स्ट आई हैव थरली वॉश्ड माई भिंडीज विद वाटर एंड आई हैव लेट दैम ड्राई ऑन अ किचन टावल एंड नाउ आई हैव कट माई भिंडी एंड अनियंस इन वन इंच साइज नाउ आई ट्राई दैम फर्स्ट Here I have added my bindi in 10 ml of oil. So I'm gonna sort them well till they get three fourth cooked or half cooked. Cooked. I'm going to add salt in it right now. So the the flavor of salt gets into them. When you mix them in the gravy, they itself have have some salty flavor. So our bindis are fried. Now we'll take them out and we'll prepare a gravy. For gravy, we need garlic and ginger. I have crushed them in a mortar. and the chopped onions and a curd and i'm going to add all the spices in it salt red pepper coriander powder haldi and then i'm going to prepare a gravy so i have took 10 ml of oil i'm going to add jeera into it it has started spluttering now i'm going to add ginger garlic paste when you add a ginger garlic paste a very nice aroma comes out of it so i've roughly chopped them into a mortar that's how i like for You get a much better flavor of it than a grinded one. So now I'm going to add my onions into it. This is called bindi do piyaza because we use onion two times in it. One in the gravy with onion and curd gravy, and one is while frying the bindi. So I'm gonna sort them well till they become translucent. Let and let it cook. Onions have become little translucent. Then let them cook more. Till then. Now the gravy is cooked. I'm going to add. Fried bindis into it. Now you can add little bit of garam masala or a kitchen king. And cover it with a lid and let it cook for. Two minutes more, and your bindi do piyaza is ready. This is the final look of our sabji. And it is ready now. Bindi do piyaza.